It spans the globe like a superhighway. It is called internet. In early mid 1990s, the concept of the World Wide Web it was a luxury. It was something that was kind of cool, but not necessarily something that was essential. You can do more than just send messages on the internet. There's there's loads of useful information in here. It was like the Wild West in a lot of ways. It was dangerous, you had had some skill, it was fun. Critics say one dangerous, this could turn out to be an elitist system, one available only to people with a computer and a modem. It really quickly became obvious that there were going to be haves and have-nots. It's kind of hard to function in today's society if you don't have access to the internet. If you want to increase innovation, get more people connected to the network. If you want to lift all boats, get everybody on, on the network. And if we're looking to the future, if we want to build a network that is going to be sustainable, reliable, and future-proof, fiber is the only technology that's going to allow you to do that. Congress is investing tens of billions of dollars right now. All homes and businesses, all essentially all facilities in the United States are going to have high-speed broadband. Broadband doesn't fall from trees. It requires the private sector to take that enterprise and to invest in next generation networks. People think, oh, but we, now we have wireless, but let's not forget, wireless only has a reach of a couple of hundred meters to a certain point, and from there you need to take the traffic elsewhere. There are approaches with satellites, but these are capacity limited. So fiber really gives you that, that scale and capacity that you need. We can't afford to get this wrong. There will never be another moment in my lifetime where we're gonna see this much attention and money poured into what is essentially a utility. This is all about protecting and elevating people who live in this country, and that's what we should be focused on. All this other stuff is politics.